Hello, my friends. How are you doing? I have some amazing AI news for you because there's always something crazy happening in the image generation universe. Let me know in the comments if you want to see a full video of any of these topics. So first of all, I want to talk about something called Style Gantt T. Now, this is a new method for image generation and it is super extra fast. So here are the numbers that compare different methods. For example, you can see here Stable Diffusion for their test render of an image with 256 by 256 pixels took around 3.7 seconds. Now, when you look at the EDIF-I method, 32 seconds. Yikes, that's not good. But when you look down there, their method of style Gantt T uses only 0.1 seconds for the same image. Now, that's amazing. And this brings us in the range where we can render, for example, video in real time with image generation. Mind blowing. Now, the next news is a bit of a beef between Civit AI and Fantasy AI, because as you know, Civit AI is one of the favorite pages to download amazing stable diffusion models for free so we all can play with them. And the open source idea is very big in the AI image generation community. But Fantasy AI wants to license a lot of the most favorite models and put them behind them. Here's an interesting interesting new development. While I was cutting the video, a new statement came out by Fantasy AI. Shout out to AI Entrepreneur and Sebastian Kamp to making me aware of this news and sending me that link. Now, what Fantasy AI is saying right now is that they will keep the download free for these models on their website, but these models are exclusive for their page for the first 14 days after release. And also this model will be exclusive to their page even after that if you want to use their page to generate images online. Now this is for now regarding the models Dream Shaper, Realistic Vision, Hassan Blend, Grapefruit, Pastel Mix, Duke Heighten, and Galaxy Time Machine. So some of the most famous models out there. Fantasy AI says that you can generate on their page 10 images per day for free. And after that, they offer a paid service to use their online GPU to render these images and they will share the profits with the model creators. Of course, there is still outrage by the community because these models are blends from other models. So it's kind of unsure if it is even possible to license work like that if this is based on other creations. But let's get back to some fun news here. This is TL Dream, a very nice script that you can download right now on GitHub. And this simplifies the usage of stable diffusion combined with control net. So you make a simple sketch and it turns it into an image with your prompt. Now, this is a very fun and easy way to get started with image generation. You can play around with that, for example, also with your kids to show them how that works. But it also can be used in other cases just as a simple way to get started. Next, we have a custom animation script for automatic 1111. And look at that image, how clear that is, how amazingly well that looks. I can't believe that this has been created with image AI. The result is mind blowing. And you can try that script to get better results with your video renders. When you go to the download page of this script, you will find a download button where you can donate money, but you don't have to. You can do the download right away if you want to. And there is a very long description on how to use that to get these amazing results. So check that out and have fun with this. Next, for all the Stable Diffusion 2.1 fans out there, is there any? Well, anyways, there is now a version of ControlNet that can be used with this. Someone has put it upon themselves to train three models for the Kenny model, the depth model and the head model to download it and use it with ControlNet. Now, of course, this comes with a big download. So each of these files is 9.59 gigabytes. But if it's worth to you, get the download started and play with 2.1 in ControlNet. 
Next, I have a really beautiful news for you, and that is Visual Chat GPT. You can download that from GitHub, install it in your own computer, and then you are in a conversation with the AI in a chat window. You can ask for images, you can even ask for changes inside of these images, and just create art by having a conversation with an AI. That's just beautiful. Thank you very much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video, and see you soon. Bye. Oh, you're still here. So uh, this is the end screen. There's other stuff you can watch like this or that's really cool. And yeah, I hope I see you soon. Uh, leave a like if you haven't yet. And well, um, yeah, 